Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to fix crash issue for shared PS4 emulator on the PC. Let's get started. Guys, I have different solutions of this problem, so do not skip any part of this video. And guys, please subscribe to my this channel. I really need more subscribers, guys. I really need your support. Please subscribe and let's start. Go to settings and go to configuration or go to this one click here and go to graphics and you need to select your GPU device if you have multiple GPU devices then you need to select your more powerful GPU device so this is my GPU device already installed in my PC and it's done click on apply and you can increase your resolution from here but I recommend by default apply and save and solution number two close your share ps4 and go to the ps4 right click and go to properties and go to compatibility and you can change the windows from here windows 7 and disable full screen optimization and change high dpi and select it and ok apply and run this program as an administrator and apply and ok solution number three go to search bar on the windows and tap your device manager go to device manager control panel and go to display adapter right click and go to properties and drivers so guys you can see already installed drivers for your GPU device you can see driver date so if you have uh, older version drivers then please update drivers first for your GPU device solution number four go to your shared ps4 right click and open file location and go to user and delete your shaders folder from here and go to camp delete it and close it Solution number five, go to search bar on the windows and tap cube, press enter and delete all files and folders from here. Solution number six, right click and go to your control panel for your NVIDIA or AMD. So this is my NVIDIA control panel, but I have AMD 5 Pro control panel also. So go to adjust image settings and check this option and select performance from here. Check it and apply. Now go to manage 3D settings, scroll down and open your rendering GPU. Select your GPU device and power management mode maximum performance already selected and texture filtering quality select high performance and click on apply and close it for more settings right click and go to display settings scroll down and go to graphic settings and delete your old application file and go to browse and go to your shared ps4 so this is my shared PS4. Right click and open file location and click on add. Options, high performance and save. And close it. Solution number seven. As you can see, this is my shared PS4. You can use shared PS4 BB version. Do not use regular version of your shared PS4. If you want to play new games in your shared PS4, so you need this one. Solution number 8. If you're still facing the issue, if you can't open your shared PS4 in your PC or laptop or any other device, then make sure you have uh, ABX or ABX2 Sport CPU. Open this folder and you need to open it. Now guys you can check your CPU if you have uh, ABX or ABX2 support CPU. You can see ABX and ABX2. If you don't have ABX and ABX2 support CPU then you can't open your shared PS4. 
So, I hope this tutorial will be helpful for you. If you like it, then please subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.